In this video, Kevin and I are going to be working our way through the limited edition Barissimo Chocolate Delight. These are flavored single serve cups. Uh, it, these are out for Valentine's Day at Aldi. This was only $6.99 at Aldi for 12 K cups. I don't think that's bad uh, because they're. Um, uh, they're special flavors. So on the back, it tells you the flavors you get. Um, and it gives a description of each one. So you get a chocolate strawberry, chocolate Neapolitan, chocolate cinnamon roll, chocolate coconut, chocolate glazed donut, rocky road, brownie batter, caramel brownie, mocha lava cake, chocolate caramel pecan cluster, chocolate hazelnut, and white chocolate strawberry. Um, it says introducing Aldi's limited edition collection, a range of products that extends from the brands you love, from your family favorites to something new. We bring this delicious collection chosen for you. So we are going to, uh, you're going to see all 12 of these in this one video, but we're going to, um, for us, it's, we're going to be trying four flavors each day. So we're going to start with the four flavors on top. We're going to go row by row. So today, we will be trying the chocolate strawberry, chocolate coconut, chocolate hazelnut, and chocolate caramel pecan cluster. So we'll be right back. So how did you make these? Keurig. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Push the button. <laughs> in the Keurig, of course. It, it has a, a sweetener and a creamer in it, like we would normally drink our coffee, because we're yes. not, we would never drink coffee black, so we would make it black. Right, um, so we put creamer yeah. and sugar in each one, and, and so throughout the video with the rest of them, they're all gonna have cream. Yeah, we're gonna make them all the same way. We're gonna make them sugar. all the same way, yes. Uh, so first, we're gonna try the chocolate strawberry. It smelled like a chocolate-covered cherry, is what it smelled like when you were cooking it. It is a decadent blend of sweet, ripened strawberries with smooth milk chocolate. It smelled more like a chocolate-covered cherry, honestly, than a chocolate over strawberry, but when I was cooking it, when I was brewing it, that's what I meant. Still tastes like cherry. I do taste the, um, I do taste the chocolate. It reminds me, it smells, the smell is exactly like it tastes to me. It, it reminds me of like a Tootsie Roll type of chocolate. I can see that. And that's what it tastes like to me. It reminds me of a, a Tootsie Roll that has a hint of strawberry in it. Um, See, I, it I taste more of that cherry, strawberry kind of flavor. I taste that more than the chocolate. Right. It's, so, it, this one's okay for me. So I like it. Um, out of, you know, you're, you're, you're only getting it once out of 12 days. Yeah. So for that one day, I could drink it. It's not my favorite. I don't dislike it. Yeah, I like it. Um, I don't drink flavored coffee. I like that. I wouldn't yeah. drink it every day, but I, would, I like yeah, it. Yeah, I would, I would get tired of it. I wouldn't mind it for that one day, but I wouldn't want a whole box of it yeah. is what I'm saying. But the good thing is, it is flavored and you can really taste the flavor. Yeah, it's not just like regular coffee they're saying it's something. No, you definitely get the flavor yeah. of it. Uh, so this next one is chocolate caramel pecan cluster and it is milk chocolate swirled with caramel and topped with freshly roasted pecans. And it smelled like pecans when I was making it. That's the benefit of us sitting here is we get to smell them while they're cooking. While they're oh, <laughs> yeah, I love that. That's the one for me. That is strong. I taste the pecans and, and I taste caramel. the caramel. Yeah. Yes, they're both very strong flavors. You don't you do get, get that. To the caramel flavor. I mean, yeah. the uh, pecan flavor too. And the really Yeah, you don't get that a lot of times mm -hmm. with coffee. Sometimes you'll get one thing or the other is stronger. That you get it all. That mm -hmm. that one is delicious. It's supposed to have co uh, chocolate too. I really didn't get the chocolate I flavor, didn't get but, chocolate. but I do get the caramel pecan for sure. It tastes like I've eaten one of those. Um, Goo Goo Clusters or uh, the Turtles or something like that. It tastes like I've eaten something like right. that with pecans. Yeah, so it, that one is delicious. Not it, a Goo Goo, that has peanuts, but you know what I mean. You're thinking of a, a, like a maple nut goodie. No. No? No, there's like the Turtles that have the pecans. The, oh, they, okay. They have pecans. Because I do think that tastes... A little bit like the... Maple. Yeah. Because the caramel is so strong, it reminds me a little bit of maple. That's I why that. I thought that's where your mind was going. No, I can see that though. That one I could drink a whole box of. Yeah, that's really good. The next one we have is the chocolate hazelnut. Uh, chocolate hazelnut. Where are we? Right here. A rich blend of warm chocolate with our popular roasted hazelnuts. And I do like it that they give a description of each yeah. one of these. I mean, it's a marketing description, but it's still a description. Kind of tells you what they're heading towards. 
Oh, wow. No, that's my favorite. That's what you have to share. It's going to be hard to beat that in the box. I can't, I, I cannot imagine anything. No. Really? Oh, and I could drink it all down right now. Oh, the hazelnut's goodness. a little too strong for me. Really? No. It, I tell you what it is. It's it's all nuttiness with very little sweetness. Oh, when I eat, when I wonder. when I eat hazelnut, it's always um, with something like a, a spread or a chocolate or a candy or something like that. Right. So I'm used to a hazelnut with a very very sweet flavors. Um, that one, it's it's just it's like I've had a handful of hazelnuts and I literally just shove them in my mouth. Like, okay. a, like a chipmunk. It's too strong for me. I could drink that exclusively for Although, months and months and months and never get tired. I of do it. like it that you can really taste it. Oh yes. The flavor is really good and strong. So the reason I keep saying this, we've had other flavor coffees that, that they said it was something and we're like, that doesn't taste anything like that. Right, right. <laughs> so this is impressive. Yeah. So far though, that is my number one. Okay, no. now chocolate coconut. And Kevin will tell you this one was very strong yeah, coconut. brewing. Uh, a hint of toasted coconut blended with rich dark chocolate. So this one's our first dark chocolate. Ooh, I like that one too. The coconut is very strong. No, I like that though. Um, I don't necessarily know that it's in dark chocolate at no, all. I really don't get the chocolate flavor. Really because the coconut is so strong. Yeah. Um, if I had, if we hadn't put creamer and sugar in there, I don't think I would have liked that. Like I wouldn't want to drink that one black because I think it would, the coconut would be like, like overpowering and non-sweet. Yes. Since we put the sweetener and the creamer in there, it tastes like a creamy, like coconut milk. Right. That's a little sweet. Yes, I agree. The coconut though is so strong that it gets up in your nasal passages and everything. <laughs> yeah, I there. mean, yeah, it is there. It's going to leave an aftertaste. Um, out of these four though. Hazelnut, definitely number one. What would be your number two? The oh, chocolate one. caramel pecan. Okay. Because I love the flavor of the, the caramel and the pecan. That would be my number one. Okay. And then I my number that. two would be the chocolate covered strawberry. That's my last. Yeah. That's you like the coconut over there? Yes, I do. I yeah. like that cherry. I keep saying cherry, but because it tasted like cherry. Yeah, to me. Um, it tasted but, more like cherry than it did strawberry. But, uh, but, I like that fruity berry flavor. I, I like that. It, it's not bad. It's just uh, I like these other flavors yeah. so much more. See, that hazelnut would be my last. So we're right. literally just flipped over completely. <laughs> but I'm the one that drinks the flavored coffee. Yeah, I'm not a flavored coffee person. So I am used to flavors being that strong. Uh, my co my normal coffee that I buy, ha the flavors, they really come across that strong. Yeah. Um, well, well, I wish the company, whoever makes these for Aldi, um, that... Barissimo. Barissimo. Um, I wish they would come out with these flavors where you can buy a whole box. A whole of box, them. yeah. But I've never seen a whole box of flavored. They have some. They have some flavors, but right. uh, only, but not, not a lot. Right. Exactly. Well, when we come back, we're gonna be dressed differently. Because <laughs> <laughs> it'll be the next day. And we're gonna try four more for you. So now we have the chocolate glazed donut, brownie batter, chocolate Neapolitan, and a chocolate cinnamon roll. So we're gonna try the chocolate glazed donut first. It is delicious <coughs> donut flavor topped with creamy milk chocolate. I'm getting a theme from this box though. Chocolate. <laughs> yes. Which makes sense. Perfect for Valentine's Day. I like that chocolate. Mm, it's different. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like a chocolate vanilla. The, but the chocolate is, it's, it's not like, it's not going to remind you of like a milk chocolate. No, it's, it's not like still you chocolate. It <laughs> still, to me, is a Tootsie Roll chocolate, but it's strong enough and it's, I actually like this better than a lot of the other ones. I have too. I, yeah. That's actually good. I can drink that. Yeah, this is nice. I could drink, um, I could even drink a whole box of Whatever it. they're using for the glaze, um, it almost has an alcohol kind of flavor to it. It's nice, yeah. yeah. It's kind yeah. of a vanilla something, yeah. creamy. Yeah, it's it, nice. It's very good. The next one is brownie batter. This one smelled like a darker chocolate. Gooey chocolate deliciousness. That's all it says. Because I get to smell these while I'm brewing them. And um, this one smelled like dark chocolate. I like this one more. This one tastes closer to a regular chocolate. 
It, 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 the, it the, does. The first one was more on the Tootsie Roll side. This one's not. This one tastes like more like traditional chocolate to me. I agree. It's not as strong though. I, or at least I didn't get as much flavor. It doesn't it. have that, whatever they use for the glaze, right. it doesn't have that. Yeah. So you're not getting that little bit but of But I'm not getting that really it. fakey artificial chocolate flavor That's either. right. It tastes like yeah. real chocolate. So, so it's, it's, I guess it's just more muted. I'm used to that really sharp artificial chocolate flavor in most of these. Right. Um, most chocolate flavor coffees, period, not just this brand. Right. Um, I, that one doesn't have it. So you're right. It's, I guess it's more like an actual chocolate. I like it more, but now you don't tell it. No, it's fine. It's, you, it's good. It's just, I didn't think the flavor was that strong. So now we have chocolate Neapolitan. It says velvety taste of sweet chocolate ice cream. It smelled like raspberry. Smell it and see what you think. Oh, it smells like definitely berry. Some kind of berry. Yeah. Smell like raspberry to me, but I think it tastes like strawberry. Yeah, it does have more of a strawberry. I could see ice cream. Yeah, Neapolitan ice cream, uh, if you don't know, it is a combination of chocolate. There's a row of chocolate, a row of vanilla, and a row of strawberry. In I used to call it Napoleon when I was little. Napoleon. <laughs> <laughs> in one container. Well, and in our house, uh, you'd get me who didn't want strawberry, so I'm digging out all the vanilla, She'd all eat the, whole the chocolate. Row. <laughs> yeah, and then somebody else is left with uh, Tammy. Yeah, that uh, that happened. I like that. I like that. I better than the brownie. I still like the brownie better, but I do like the Neapolitan because yeah, it like has it. a really nice strawberry chocolate mm -hmm. flavor. Yeah, it's it's really nice. Uh, the last chocolate one, cinnamon roll. Chocolate cinnamon roll is indulge with the delectable blend of chocolate drizzle and cinnamon cake. So this one's all going to depend on how strong the cinnamon is. It smells good and sweet. That's probably one of the best cinnamon rolls oh, yeah, that's I've nice. had in coffee because they did an awesome job with a, a combination of cinnamon and sugar. <coughs> yep. It's not just all cinnamon powder, but they had enough sugar in that to really, really represent a cinnamon roll. Yeah. That is so good. Yeah, it's almost like you get the baked flavor of the cinnamon roll. Yeah, it's, it's I, very good. I very rarely, I don't know if I've ever said, I could drink a whole box of cinnamon roll. I could drink a whole box of that cinnamon it, roll it, because it is they very did it good. so well. I like it too. Um, um, that may be actually... One of the best here, yeah. I still, I'm gonna say the brownie batter is the one for me, but I'm gonna say my second is the cinnamon roll. If I want just regular coffee that has just a lighter flavor for me, I would pick the brownie batter because it yeah. really doesn't have a lot of chocolate flavor for me. But if I'm gonna drink a flavored coffee, I think I'd either go, I think I'd go for the cinnamon roll. For Yeah, for if you wanted more of a flavor that cinnamon roll, you, you cannot beat yeah, that. And it's well balanced. Yeah. I don't get a really strong chocolate flavor, but that's probably a good thing. And there are people that are watching that that are more conscious of everything that Aldi has. So maybe you have seen a box of all cinnamon roll and you can tell us about yeah. it because some people know everything that Aldi sells. You know, if that's the only store they shop in right. and they're there know. all the time, you would know. Whereas you and I typically, when we're going down the coffee aisle, we go aisle, through the coffee aisle. We go, we just walk though. We're yeah. not looking at it. Yeah, really. they don't have a lot of cups. They have just regular coffee cups, but they don't have a lot. Of, I don't. I've never seen a lot of flavored cups. Right. But I could just be missing them too. Exactly. Or maybe they only come out at certain times of the year. Right. So. so we will be back in just a second with the last four. So now we have the white chocolate strawberry caramel brownie, and a rocky road and mocha lava cake. So the white chocolate strawberry is rich white chocolate swirled with sweet strawberry cream. Sounds wonderful. And I can tell you there were a couple of these that were a little smelly brewing. They were stinky. I don't mind that. No, it's not bad. No, the, you do taste the, the strawberry. The white chocolate is, it's a creamy, lighter flavor. It, um, it has a little bit of a, a waxy flavor. Mm -hmm. Like if you were burning a light scented strawberry candle and you were to, to taste that wax. That's what you imagine it tasting like. That's what I imagine it tasting like. See, I, I, when I was brewing it, I, I told Tanya, I said, this smells like 
um, strawberry lip gloss. Oh, this was the one that lip yeah. gloss. Okay, yeah, I can I can understand that because lip gloss is waxy. Yeah, get that waxy candle kind of. waxy. So that it's okay for yeah. one cup, but I definitely wouldn't be buying a box, box of it. Now, yeah. so next we have the caramel brownie, and it says sweet creamy caramel draped over rich chocolate. We'll see. I don't like it. It's the brownie. It um, it that tastes caramel. like cheap. It tastes cheap. Yeah, the caramel flavor is okay, but then it's added with that very very artificial ch chocolate flavor, which yeah. makes it. Yeah, you get your cheap lip gloss chocolate. chocolate. Yeah, <laughs> your yes, your lip gloss chocolate. Yeah, yeah. your Tootsie Roll uh, lip gloss chocolate. Yeah. that's what that's. Very like. artificial. Would chocolate not flavor. want a whole box of that either. No. You you would feel like you're drinking something cheap. Yeah. Um, the next one is Rocky Road. Rocky Road is uh, reminiscent of your favorite ice cream, milk chocolate, toasted almond, and cream. Oh. That's not what I was thinking at all for Rocky Road. Yeah, I don't remember almonds in Rock Road. Might be almonds in Rock Road, I don't know. I thought it was just marshmallow. <laughs> that, I, I could buy a whole box of that. That is delicious, yes. That's because the almond flavor is really strong. I love it, and it, it, yes, it is wonderful. It has a very almondy, nutty kind of flavor. It's terrific. It, out, of the, out of the one so far, definitely, that's, that's a better that, one. It, that is terrific. And if they had that uh, Rocky Road, a whole box of Rocky Road, I would definitely buy a whole yeah. box of it. Yeah. Um, it. It's good. It is. Uh, I'm left with the aftertaste of that nutty kind of texture. Yes, of flavor. it's nutty and sweet and creamy and overall uh, delicious. Mm. It's not strong. None of these are strong like... like Bitter, wake strong you up coffee. in the morning. No. no, these are meant for everybody to mm -hmm. enjoy. Okay, the last one is mocha lava cake. Mm -hmm. uh, mocha lava cake is warm caramel blended with delicious dark chocolate. Hmm. So I'm expecting this one to be bitter. <laughs> it's not though. It does taste like Tootsie Roll chocolate, but it's actually good. Yeah, it's, it's better. Yes. Where the other ones tasted like like the lip gloss chocolate, this doesn't taste like lip gloss. This just tastes like Tootsie Roll. Yeah. And I could, it's okay. I could. If you had a box, you could I make your way box, through it. If I had a box, I could make my way through yeah. it. It kind of reminds me of those... Um, Hostess coffees we bought a while back, and they came with a, they had like a yeah. Twinkie flavor, and they had like a, a snowball, snowball, and yeah. there was a chocolate one that, too. That, I agree. That kind of does remind you of that. Kind that of reminds thing. me of that. So yes, I could definitely make my way through a whole box. Mm. It wouldn't be my first choice, but I could do it. Um, well, I didn't like really care for the first two at all. No, not really. Not really. Um, but the but the last two were pretty decent. Right. Um, not my favorites out of the bunch though. My favorite. Really. My favorite out of the whole bunch was that caramel one. You love the chocolate caramel, and so did I. Chocolate caramel pecan cluster. And that one. And uh, the chocolate cinnamon roll. Yeah, either one of those, I can buy a whole box of. Um, I also. And I don't drink flavored coffee either. I like the chocolate hazelnut. Yeah, I'm, you liked it better than I did. I'm gonna say that for for my number one out of the whole box. It would be that chocolate hazelnut, and then I'm gonna say the chocolate caramel pecan cluster. But then third, I'm gonna say this Rocky Road, yeah. and then fourth, it would be the chocolate cinnamon roll. Yeah. But I um, think this is a neat box. I think um, you get enough different flavors and enough good flavors to where it's worthwhile. I, I do think, too. I think it's worth it. I think it's very, very uh, worth the price. It was a good price, and you get. 12 different days, uh, you know, if you... You don't have to drink 12 supper days, you can drink two a day. If oh yeah, if you drink two cups, of, two or three cups of coffee a day and enjoy them, why not? But uh, these, uh, I definitely think this would be a good one to get because there were very few that we, even the ones that we didn't like, you could still drink them. So yeah. like even this white chocolate strawberry, you you're gonna be it. like, no, it's not my favorite one in there, but it's not so bad I have to pour it down the sink. Now, what do you think about, okay, I am a guy or girl buying it from my significant other and 
they really love flavored coffee. Do you think this would be a good Valentine gift to give oh, them? Oh, yeah, I do. I think it is, too. I really do. If they really like flavored coffee, though, that's the key. Because, like, Tammy would buy it for me because I don't yeah. really drink flavored coffee. Because Kevin, uh, yeah. But Kevin would I buy it for Tammy? Sure, she drinks yes. flavored coffee all the So, time. yes, I do think it's a, a very good gift. Mm -hmm. uh, so, if you see these around, uh, I would pick one up. It's cheap. It, it, I think you're go going to enjoy yeah. it. So, I hope you've enjoyed this video, and thanks for watching.